Hey everybody, welcome back to VGC Series 10, where today, at the request of one of our uh, loyal followers here, we're making Arctazolt. Um, they basically were like, hey, I know you really like Arctivish, but I really like Arctazolt, can you make an Arctazolt team? So I did. And <laughs> let me tell you, Arctazolt feels a lot more aggressive than Arctivish. Its typing is a lot more offensive, if that makes sense. Whereas Arctivish has a little bit more of a defensive typing. <laughs> Arctazolt has a very aggressive typing. Um, so here's the team. We're running Scarf Ninetales just because I want to try out this set mostly. Um, Blizzard, Free Drive, Moonblast, Icy Wind. We're running just enough speed to outspeed Calyrex Shadow with our Choice Scarf. Um, and honestly, it's been working pretty good. We're running Arctazolt. Um, again, just enough speed to outspeed uh, Calyrex Shadow. Slush Rush, Life Orb. Um, really because I figured that... Uh, we would be using our ice attack more often than we would use an ice attack attack on Arctivish. So I wanted to be able to boost that attack too instead of just running like a, a battery or something. I'm sorry, a magnet. Bolt Beak, Ice Crash, Stone Edge, Protect. Um, with Bolt Beak and Ice Cold Crash, basically if you call it right, nothing can switch in on Arctizolt. Which is actually kind of nuts, because they can like switch into Grass type, right? But if you Ice Cold Crash, they can't switch in. Same thing with Ground types. Same thing with trying to switch in water type in on your ice cold crash. Like if you call it right, there's there is no switch in. <laughs> um, Palkia, um, it really just complements these two mods well. It deals with a lot of rock types, fire types they don't want to deal with, and we have access to Trick Room. So if we don't want to have hail or we they're gonna like a tailwind or something up, Trick Room, we're good to go. <laughs> um, Hydro Pump, Spatial Ran, it's all it's all pretty decent. Um, Celesteela. Um, I'm running Celesteela mostly for Wide Guard and Azernia's counter. Um, our Azernia's matchup isn't isn't bad actually, but um, it helps a little bit, you know. That and Wide Guard is just really good. It's bulky Celesteela with uh, basically no offensive investment. For running Iron Head, it deals chunks to Xernia still. And then um, last two mons, DD Female with a Sash, Max Special Attack. Um, honestly, like. Offensive in DD is just kind of nuts. In this format, it's been really, really good, and like I've, I'm seeing it how good it is on this team. And the Blastoise, um, I just I kind of want to just like some kind of fake out support, uh, but I didn't want a Fire type because I already have so many Pokemon weak to um, rocks. You know what I mean? So <laughs> that's that's the team. Um, I was gonna change stuff. I'd probably switch out Celesteel and Blastoise. They kind of never come. When they come, they do their jobs, so, you know. Let's see if we can get some good games here. Um, this Kyogre team. Was it in was it in Players Cup 4? I haven't watched it yet, but I feel like everybody's been running this Kyogre team specifically. You know what I mean? Um, so against this, we're gonna lead Arctazolt Palkia. We bring Ninetales in the back. Um, I think we go in Didi. It is a very solid Kyogre team. I'm not like poking fun or anything. Like it's a good team. It's just, it's just weird that I uh, have been seeing it so often, you know. All right, they lead a Lecky Tornadoes, so they kind of lean into the lead that we didn't want here. Um, I kind of want to just Bolt Beak. Ooh, actually, if they Volt Switch, I want to Bolt Beak there, and then. I think I'm just going to protect. If they Volt Switch, we can Bolt Beak whatever comes in. They just D-Bolt? Okay, that's fine. Ooh, they double up into Palkia. That tells me they d probably don't have Taunt. Which is actually kind of okay for us. Let me think about this. Hmm. I'm going to go an Ice Cold Crash, and then I think I'm going to Trick Room. I think we take this double up. We absolutely take the double up. We're confused though. Confusion will KO us. <sighs> okay, thank you, Palkia. You are a godsend. Now Serena comes in. That's kind of not great. I'm not gonna lie. Um, it probably underspeeds us in Trick Room. But I can just Ice Bolt Crash. And I think I'm going to switch you into D this turn. Yeah, they go for the Grassy Glide. That did a lot of damage. That did a lot of damage. 
That didn't do that much damage. Okay, um, hmm. I think I'm gonna Bolt Beak Expanding Force and we'll see how it goes. Nope. They are slower than us. And I have to switch into Kyogre now. But that's fine. That still KOs, even with the berry. Fun fact. <laughs> uh, it's kind of nuts. Okay, um... If we call when the Serena's attacking properly, we can go off here, right? Have we revealed Protect yet? No, but we have revealed that we're at least not a, a choice item. I'm gonna Protect and go for the Spatial Rend. Yes, we call it right. Peace, homie. Um, mm. Getting the terrain up is not good, though. Hopefully it's Scarf and it has to Ice Beam. Oh, yeah, it must be Scarf. <laughs> We've been, Yeah, I think that Kyogre on this specific team is Scarf. Uh, so if you ever see it, remember that it's Scarf. And if they lock themselves in Ice Beam, they'll be stuck into it forever. <laughs> All right, let's get another game. That was great. Yeah, Arctazolt kind of just like flexes on so many things. Okay. All right. Let me think about this here. Um, so the only thing that's super scary to me on lead here is Vileplume. Vileplume is very scary. I don't have anything that switches in on Bioplume. Hmm. Okay, I think I'm gonna go Palkia Blastoise on lead here. I think. And I think we bring Ninetales, and I think we bring Arctazolt. Really? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Okay, Groudon, Bioplume. Exactly what I was expecting. Okay, I'm gonna Trick Room and fake out the Bioplume. That's our best play. Okay, they switch into Moltres. We get the fake out. Flinch. Um, we should be slower than both of these mons, I think. If they're running any speed investment at all on the Moltres. I'm gonna go ahead and spatial rend and Um, I'll just flip turn out into Arctazolt. Ooh, okay. Okay. We don't get the KO either. That really sucks. Oh, that's really bad. Um. Alright, we just kind of have to hope we wake up here. I think our play is definitely Icicle Crash and a Vile Plume. Ooh, they switch. They call that. Okay, that hurts. And we know now that they are, in fact, slower than us in Trick Room. This Moltres was kind of tailor built for this, huh? Um, mm. All right, let's get Blastoise in. They recover, that's fine. Foul play doesn't do that much. Wake up, please. No. That's really rough. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and just fake out the Moltres. Now we wake up, right? Yeah. How? bulky is it? It's, it's it's so bulky. It's got to be Assault Vest. That's really rough. Um, okay. So we know that Blastoise is the slowest thing on the field, right? Hopefully they don't Trick Room. I'm gonna go ahead and just Spatial Rend into Moltres again. And flip turn on Porygon. That's fine. Flip turn... Get Arctazolt in. Oh, no. We're going to lose this game, I think. Actually, wait. It might be okay. I'm going to Blizzard. I don't think Blizzard loses accuracy in the sun to either. Groudon does come in, though, which is kind of what I expected. But we hit it like a truck. But they trick room. I don't like that. I really, really don't like that. 
Um, okay, what's the fake out? And Blizzard. They protect. I mean, that's fair, I guess. Um, gosh. Hmm. They don't know that we're Scarf. I wasn't ready for a, the one Sun team that was ready for everything I was going to try. That's crazy. It's kind of nuts, actually. I'm going to yawn and switch into, Gra into Palkia. Ooh, the Porygon's slower than Blastoise. That's kind of a big, big oops. Alright, let's go for the Blizzard and the Hydro Pump. Uh, I feel like they have to switch here. They don't have a switch in for Blizzard. They actually just don't have a switch in for Blizzard. Um, so I'm gonna Hydro Pump Porygon. Moltres Galler switches in, that's fine. There's my Kale. Ooh, Hail? Does Hail damage do it? Not on Porygon, but definitely on Moltres, which means Groudon gets to come back in for free. And we're stuck in Blizzard. <sighs> Man, this Porygon's just gonna recover. That sucks pretty bad. Ooh, I just died of Precipice Blades. Oof. Alright, yeah, I mean... <laughs> good, good job, man. Okay, let's get another one. This is gonna probably be packed with battles. These battles are kind of short. Um, Trick Room teams give us a little bit of a problem, but not like a giant problem. Um, I feel like maybe we can just lead really aggressively here. I feel like I'm gonna just lead really aggressively. We'll bring Palkia in the back and then, um, I kind of don't have much to deal with the, the Necrozma. I kind of want to bring in Didi to change the terrain. I think that's what I'm going to go for. Um, but also Psychic Terrain helps Necrozma if they're running Photon Geyser. So that's kind of scary. We lead aggressively and I think we get rewarded for it. Although, Urshifu is really scary. Urshifu is extremely scary. I want to go for... I'm just going to Blizzard because it's Urshifu Dark. Um, and I'm going to switch, I think. I think I have to. I really don't want to. Dang. Dang, Alecky is so good. The one thing I hate about Reggie Alecky is it's, it's like impossible to speed creep it unless you already have a high speed stat. <laughs> like, think about how good Arctivish and Arctizolt would be if the fastest thing in the format was Calyrex and not Alecky. Um, they're, they're definitely just gonna like... Electroweb, right? I think we have to gamble on which Pokemon they're gonna hit, I guess. Electroweb... Who do they decide to target? It's the Ninetales. Okay, well, Bolt Peak should knock you down to your Sash. No! No, because we didn't move first. That really sucks. I really don't like that. <sighs> Oof. Um. Alright, well, I'll just Ice Cold Crash, I guess. We're gonna... I think we lose. This, this lead messed us up, man. That's a big oof. Hurry up. Pick your moves, man. We got other games to play. What are you scared of? Uh-huh. I mean, that's fair. Um, I don't know if we can beat whatever's in the back. To be completely honest with you. Yeah, that's kind of rough. Um, okay. Hydro Pump. Expanding Force. They Volt Switch out. Like he said, I don't want to take responsibility for this. That's a big oof. Holy cow. Protect. Protect. That would have KO'd if they let us keep our terrain. But then I guess maybe we would have done a significant amount more damage to them. So They don't Trick Room, which is nice. Um, okay. Man, um, I have to 
Hydro Pump, follow me. I really don't like that play. Oh, I guess we just lose. Do we miss the Hydro Pump? They're faster than me? Why are you running so much speed? What? Okay. All right, let's get another one. Like I said, this team's really aggressive, and if you can't uh, if you can't get the aggressive playoff on turn one, it really hurts. Okay. Um. Hmm. 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 I think I'm gonna go Arctis Ult Palkia here. I think we bring Nine Tails, and hmm. I think I'm feeling Blastoise. Um, I would really like to change the terrain from Rillaboom, but I'm feeling Blastoise. Alright, Rillaboom Zacian is a lead I could very well expect. Encoding overloaded, I don't like that. The safest play here is to just double protect, but... I think I'm going to Trick Room. All right, well, we call that right. Ooh, we call, we call a lot of things right. That was a great turn. Holy cow. Holy cow. All right, um... This zayton has got to protect, right? So I'm just going to double up into Rillaboom. I'd be very surprised if the Zacian doesn't protect this turn. Okay, yeah, there's the protect. Woodhammer does not KO. We are Palkia. Icicle Crash. Ooh, just gets this flat KO. All right, that's nice. This grassy terrain is actually helping us a little bit. Uh, um, what comes in? Incineroar? Did they bring it? Would you bring Incineroar in this position? Yeah. Okay, I mean, that's fair. Let's switch into Blastoise here and just protect this turn. Blastoise does not mind taking a Behemoth Blade. Oh, free substitute for them. That's kind of rough. Um, okay. Let me think. Yawn is not a sound-based move, just in case anybody was wondering. Um, I'm going to Scald and Hydro Pump into Zacian, I think. Just to break the substitute. Yeah, that's fine. I knew that was coming. That's why I didn't bother to Hydro Pump into Incineroar. Uh, and they Sacred Sword, and Blastoise takes, like, no damage from that. Um, okay, let me think. I'm gonna Flip Turn, and then Hydro Pump into Zacian again. They're gonna Protect or Switch or something, but... Ooh, Double Protect. No! No, the Zacian does not Protect. Um, okay, that's fine. Let me just Yawn here. Um, hmm. I think I'm going to go for Hydro Pump into Volcarona. I don't expect to get it off, but if we get it off, it'd be kind of big. Alright, we live that. That's great. Uh, we definitely take that. Is that the only attacking move you have? That was kind of a bad play. Ooh. Well, that's beautiful. <laughs> oh, no. Protect. They were too scared of the Arctazolt. They weren't ready for Palkia Blastoise. Ooh, sub is a good call there. Um, great. Wow. Um, okay. I'm going to flip turn into Ensign. We're going to Hydro Pump Zacian. Because we need to break the sub. I would love to be able to Spatial Ren, but unfortunately Zacian is immune to, <laughs> to dragons. We break the sub. That's fine. I'm actually f perfectly okay with that. We get the KO there. Arctazolt comes in. Nine Tails comes in. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, let's do another. This is great. This is a fun team. Yo, man, give me give me 10 likes, I'll make this team in-game. I already have all these Pokemon. <laughs> give me 10 likes. I'll do it. I'll give you a rental code and everything. Um, okay. 
How do we fare against another Palkia team? I actually don't know. I think I'm gonna go Arctozolt Ninetales. We're gonna bring in Didi. And we're gonna bring Palkia and we're gonna see how that goes. Do you guys think Arctozolt can swim? I kind of feel like it can't. I feel like Arctozolt can't swim, and that makes me feel even worse for it. Like, you know what I mean? You think this is Scarf Entei? If this is Scarf Entei, I'm very scared. But why would you run Scarf Entei on a Palkia team? Oh, actually, there's probably plenty of reasons to run Scarf Entei on a Palkia team, right? I'm gonna go Freeze Dry and Bolt Peak, and we're gonna see if it's Scarf. It's not Scarf. We don't quite get the KO, but the Freeze Dry should KO. Oh no, that's a bulky Palkia. That's fine, actually. But I'm I'm okay with how that turn went. Because now we bring in Ndidi, right? Ooh. Freeze dry. Oh, man. I might even just expanding force, to be honest. Yeah, I'm just gonna expanding force. Rillaboom comes in. Okay, that's fair. That means the freeze dry is free. They don't know that we're Scarf. And we cannot click a uh, blizzard. I'm gonna just do that again. Okay, I mean, that's fair. <laughs> that's kind of fair. We take the U-turn because we are Focus Sash. I mean, we would have taken it anyway, I guess. That's great. Palkia comes in. Uh, Hydro Pump. Follow me. Ah, Fake Out. I forgot about Fake Out. Do we take enough attacks? Can we win this? I, that was kind of sloppy of me. I should have double protected. That's a big oof on my part. Ah, uh, we... Holy cow! Oh, man. This is attack boosting stack attacker? Ooh. I completely forgot about fake out. That's a big oof for me. Alright, well, that's fine. Oh, uh, let's do one more. This will be the last one, I think. You know, lots of wins, lots of losses. Like, I feel like this, we're, we're getting a balanced experience. Hey, look, it's that same Kyogre team again. Isn't that crazy? How that keeps happening? It's almost like it was good in a tournament or something. I don't Did it win? Does anybody know? I, you know, I don't know. Don't spoil it for me. Just tell me if it was in Players' Cup 4. I haven't watched it yet. I've been working. I haven't had time. I couldn't watch the live stream. All right, this is this is just fine. Do you think they have taunt? The question of the day is, do you think they have taunt? Okay, so we call this right, we win. If they taunt, if they don't have taunt, we want to trick room. If they're just going to go for tailwind, we want to just switch it nine tails. I think I'm going to go for trick room because we don't really lose anything if we call this wrong. They go for the tailwind. Oh, buddy. Baby boy. <laughs> you have made a fatal error. Bolt Beak, Hydro Pump, Weavile doesn't take this. Smack. <laughs> it's not Sash. Oh no, we missed the, we missed the Hydro Pump. Oh, the Tornadoes is probably Sash. I, I don't remember. Urshifu Water, buddy pal guy, my friend. How much did we take from Hurricane? 37? Okay, so we take another Hurricane? I'm gonna just do that same thing again. Bolt Beak. There's the Sash. Hello, Focus Sash. That means that we KO Tornadus. I am perfectly okay with that. Because now we get Ndidi in. And we just win. Because Ndidi's great. We didn't even need Hail. Isn't that crazy? Spatial Rend. This man got blindsided by the Arctozolt. No protect on the Kyogre. That's right, it's Scarf. That's a big oof, pal. Yeah. <laughs> GG, man. I'm sorry, he just left. Oof. Huh. All right, well, that's that's it, guys. Um, I didn't. I don't think I said it at the beginning of the video. If you like this video, leave me a like. Uh, leave me a comment. Tell me what Pokemon you want to see in Series 10. We just did Arctozolt last video. We did Landorus. We did Glalie. Like... I'm, I'm open to suggestions. Um, 
What was I going to say? Oh, check out the Andy Lee Discord server. It's in the description. That's where I post. Um, that's where I post. I'll post like all my rental codes and stuff in there too. Um, so you don't have to like search through all my videos to find them. Um, and then everybody in there is just really nice. Um, they're all help, they'll all help you team build. If you feel like you're not very good at team building, I'll help you team build. I'm in there. Um, if you want to challenge me a battle, it's the only way to do it is to join the Discord server. Um, with that, my name is Andrew, and I'll catch you guys next time.